This is part two of three on how to slow down the films from a Wolverine film to digital movie maker to the proper speed for 8mm and Super 8 film. I'm double clicking the shortcut to Windows Movie Maker. Again, don't confuse it with Windows Media Player. I am now clicking here to unmaximize the screen so I can drag my films in. This is an 8mm film shot at 16 frames a second. This is a Super 8 film done at 18 frames a second. I am re-maximizing the window. I am now selecting the 8mm film done at 16 frames per second. I am selecting video tools. Where it says speed, I'm putting in 0.533 to match the 16 frames per second of the 8mm film. I am now selecting the Super 8 film. This black bar, I am grabbing it by left single clicking it and holding the click and dragging it over just a little bit and then letting the left click go. I am going to split the clip. By single left clicking, I split the Super 8 clip into two separate clips. By left single clicking the one on the left, I have selected it. I am changing its speed to match the 18 frames per second by putting in 0.6. Remember, it does not change the speed until I hit enter on my keyboard. Now I am selecting the second part of the Super 8 film and just for fun I am changing its speed to three times the Wolverine speed which is already 40% too fast. I am backing up the Super 8 film just a bit to show the changes I made. I am hitting play. It starts at 0.6 speed and boom it speeds up three times. I am stopping this movie so that it won't be a distraction. I am now going up to file. Down here I am selecting save project as to save the project. I'm going to save it on my desktop. In the file name I am calling it dog in yard project. Click save. I am minimizing the window to show my desktop. Here it is. Do not confuse the project with the movie. We saved the project not the movie. Now we are going to save the movie by going to File, Save Movie. This is for older computers not using 16x9 definition displays. Since I have a high definition display, I am selecting it. I'm not hitting Save yet because I want to change the name of the movie to Dog and Yard. This brings up the progress box. It takes about two minutes on my computer, so I'm skipping to the end. We are now at the end. I am closing this Play Your Movie box so I can show you the movie on the desktop. I minimize the window to show the desktop. Here's the movie. This is the movie with all the changes. I double clicked it to start the film. I will skip to the Super 8 part with the dog on roof so you can see the changes. Watch how the dog speeds up at the end. That's it for part 2 of 3. Part 3 is for people who are brand new to video editing programs. If you are a vet veteran of video editing, you will probably want to pass on part 3. If you are new to video editing, it will definitely be worth your while. This is Ron of Super 8 to Video signing off. In just a minute, you'll see a screen just like the one I am filming with my camera now on my computer. Click on this white icon and then click on this. This takes you to my web page. Scroll down a little bit 
These three green rectangles are part one, two, and three of how to slow the Wolverine's copied films to the proper speed. With this purple rectangle, you can download Windows Movie Maker for free. It's not as rich in features as Video Studio, but it will get the job done. These three coming soon rectangles will host part one, two, and three of how to set the proper speed for Wolverine films using Video Studio's film editing program. This forthcoming soon rectangle will have a tutorial on the differences between Video Studio X8, X9, and their latest X10 videos editing as of March 27, 2017. This link takes you to Video Studio Ultimate X10 where you can download and try it for 30 days for free. This link takes you to Amazon where you can get more information on Video Studio Ultimate X9 or purchase it there. I'll be shutting the camera off and the screen will go live for two minutes giving you a chance to link to any of these videos I just showed you. It's going live right now. You now have two minutes to click on the icon to go to the web page I just showed you. I'll be silent now and let you make your choice. 